Hey, what's up everybody? This is Jerry from Cool X and I just got done finished recording a video on my DJI Pocket 3. So I have my DJI Pocket 3 attached to my iPad mini and I want to show you how to transfer it onto your iPad mini very simply and put it into Final Cut Pro. So first of all, you have to go to the home button. So you click on the home button on the right hand side and what you'll see is you'll see the album right here on the bottom. You click on the album. It will actually show you everything that you've recorded. So here goes my video I have right here for 11 minutes and 14 seconds. I'm going to click on it. And then it actually has to the point where you can actually edit from here or you can take it straight into uh, downloading to your device. So right here when you go to download, you press the download button right here. And it does take a second, but if you notice right here, it shows it's about 25 millibytes per second. So this is gonna take a quick second, so I'm just gonna fast forward through this part until it gets downloaded and show you the rest of it. One eternity later. But realistically, this took about five minutes to download, work into the Wi-Fi at the 23 to 26 megabytes per second. So once it gets done downloading, it will actually show that it's been downloaded. So the next step you do is pretty simple, is you just go into your Final Cut now. I'm gonna go open new project. Then I'm gonna go to my photos. And right there it goes, the 11 minutes and 14 seconds. You select it. It'll go straight into your timeline and now you can drag it right into your final cut and start editing. So you guys, this is a very nice little setup. It does transfer faster if it's directly plugged in, but this is an all-in-one solution for you where it comes to this DJI Pocket 3 with your iPad mini downloading it onto the device and putting it in Final Cut Pro and start editing. But thanks for watching, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.